Hi guys, this is Saro. In this video, we will learn how we can create Ninja Fruit Catching Game in MIT App Inventor. So here you can see that's our game here, right? And that's the first screen of our game. So we need to click on just play button and your game will start. And here you can see that's the amazing button design. There's some background design, right? So let's click on this play button. And here you can see that's ninja and that's fruit. You have to catch all these fruits, right? And whenever you catch fruit, your score, score will increase. Here you can see three. And you will get some bonus score also. So whenever fruits will collide with each other, then we will get some bonus point. Okay. So here you can see whenever both this will right collide, so you will get some bonus. Now you have to catch. And here you can see the we have three life. Here you can see three heart, right? So now let me just let it go. This banana, and here you can see we remaining two lives. If I will just catch this one and let it go about this, and you can see we have only one life right now, and just let it go. This one fruit also, then game will over, and you will find here is score and see you can see game over the screen and your score is 22 and you can restart your game by pressing this button right so that's amazing game and i have done a lot of work on this game on design and functionality and let me know if i have some more idea about this game so i will definitely try to implement your idea and in this video we will learn about design how we can design this overall game okay and second part we will create how we can code for this game so here we go so we are using here mit app inventor to create this game so you have to just log in into this mit app inventor .mit .edu platform and then click on start new project and my project name is fruit game and let's see so let's create first screen it means a start game screen okay so we need to drag and drop one layout here and that one is vertical arrangement and make this with this fill parent and make this hide fill parent like this and we have to change this background image of this vertical arrangement so here you can see the image option just click on it click on upload file click on choose file and i will give with you all assets of this game in the description okay so you can download all these assets so i have to choose the first background here you can see that's the background here click on okay so here you can see that's our background here now we have to add on one play button here right so you can use simple button but this will not look uh, uh, like attractive so that's why we are using your image component okay and you can see user interface just drag and drop this image here and make sure you have to check this image as a clickable image okay and then click on vertical arrangement and make this center and make this one also center so image is here right now now click on this image click on picture option click on upload file click on choose file and i already have that one png play dot png okay just click on this file and upload it and here you can see play this button and that's the screen now you can change this uh, button size from here just hide make it as a pixel you can make it 200 and with this make it 500 so this will look fine right now right you can change size here now that's our first screen right now let's go to the block uh, let's make it as a height visible of and now we need to create here another screen is our game screen main screen now we have to drag and drop one more layout for second screen is vertical arrangement and make this with this fill parent and hide as fill parent like this and we have to drag and drop two things here one layout that one is horizontal arrangement and for second one is the canvas for designing your game right and make this canvas is hide as fill parent and make this with this fill parent and click on this horizontal arrangement and make this hide as at least 10 percent we will create your button okay now we need to just make this with this fill parent like this 
okay now let's create change this background of canvas so just click on canvas and you will find here option as background image click on it click on upload file click on choose file and i already have one background is this one just click on this background image and okay you can see that's our background now click on this horizontal arrangement okay and we have to change this background also so click on this image option click on upload file click on choose file and we have to select one background okay this image is here right now so i'm going to upload this image so you can see that's the image here so we have to use here two buttons to move our ninja okay so click on user interface and you'll find button just drag and drop one button and then second button okay and then we have to click on this button one and remove this text and click on button two and remove this one also text right now click on this button two and click on this image option click on upload file click on choose file Go game and this one image arrow fine and we have to make this hide is and you can make it pixel 100 and width is 200 how it's look uh, no it's not look pretty well so I'm to make it 100 let's see how it's look yeah it's fine now just click on horizontal arrangement and make this one center and make this one also center like this okay click on this another button one image and just delete this one and just call control con button 2 and control C and control V like this and now I'm going to change this button to background color so we don't need to change height and weight also that thing that's why we just copy and paste it fine we have to drag and drop one label here to display a score so remove this text and use here zero and make sure this font size at least 30 or you can make it 40 yeah fine now so that's our scroll that's our two buttons here and that's our background now we have to drag and drop here some images and not images the image spread so click on drawing animation image spread just try and drop this this one is our character robot or ninja character and this one is fruit second fruit and that one is third fruit and then we have to use her three life also first life second life and that one is third life like this now click on this one image image spread one and click on the picture option click on upload file click on choose file and we have to upload this main you can upload this man and you can upload this ninja right i will give you both the character in the description so you can use any and you can use your own character also click on open and click on ok now we have to change this hide and width so i am to make it 300 and width is 200 it's still it's too big so i am to make it height is 100 and width is 50 how this one look yeah this one is fine pretty fine right now okay now that's our design now fine now let's add on some images here click on this image okay and then click on this picture option click on upload file click on choose file and then we have to add some fruits image that one I have for one.png I'm to add on this image and make sure this image height should be 50 pixel okay you have to set with this 50 pixel right and then make sure this should be also 50 50 and that one is also 50 50 like this okay and then again add on some picture click on upload file click on choose file add another banana and then add another one more is we have one more food watermelon yeah this one fine so now we have to add the health image right so we will add here how to image so click on this image and click on this picture option make sure this one is also height should be 3 30 pixel 
make it 30 pixel and with it 30 pixel right and just click on picture option click on upload file click on choose file and click on this live png and okay and then i'm now going to add on so i'm just going to delete this picture okay just delete this one make sure this one is main this one is canvas and this one is image split you can delete this picture and you just need to copy and paste your image okay just click on it control c then control v and control v like this so this will be easy for you right like this three images so it means three life three fruits one ninja background here some image everything is amazing now just click on this screen and we will remove this this one uh, you can see here that one is bar screen bar right so i'm going to remove this and i'm to make this one like remove this title and you can uh, change your title like game and fruit game something like that okay so that's our design here right now let's see how it's worked so you can see that's the design right but you can see here that's the ninja and that's not a good position for this right so what we will do just go to the design and click on this and you will find this image split y value is 179 right so i'm going to make it 279 like this and let's see how it's this fine but this should be more here right so i'm to make it i'm to increase this and i'm to make it 320 okay let's see how it's work this one is fine right this one is perfect for it right so now let's go to the design so i'm to make it visible off make sure actually i have just renamed all these layouts okay it's like this one horizontal arrangement so you can change this rename this one is start ly this one another so make sure you have to rename all these layouts name like this uh you can just click on this layout click on this rename and you can just change your layout name right so i already have changed all these layouts name right so you can change it now i have renamed this vertical arrangement this one to as a main layout because that one is main layout for our game right so i'm going to make it visual off and this one is start ly it means that one is first one vertical arrangement this one is start game so i just make this one name is start layout right so now whenever someone click on this button okay so you can you have to rename this button also so i just make it start img so now go to the block section and whenever someone click on this start img button it means this one is the image right so whenever someone click on this image right make sure this should be clickable right and go to the block and we have to hide this one layout and we have to display our main layout right so go to the, uh, the block section click on start image click on start ly and make sure this one visible should be false okay like this and then we have to display main ly main layout so i'm to make it main layout too like this right so whenever someone click on this play button this will dis this will hide and our main layout will be displayed let's see how it's work so we can see that's the screen now click on this play button and here you can see that's our second screen right so that's the overall design we have completed right now okay so tomorrow we will learn how we can code for this game okay so I will give you the all these assets link in the description and let me know if you have any doubt you can ask me on comment so thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe my channel like this video share this video have a nice day be safe bye bye